Assalamualaikum and hi, my name is Siti Sarah Betty Kamar Zaman. I'm from School of Physics, majoring in Pure Physics and a first year student. In this video, I'm a script writer. Assalamualaikum and hi everyone, my name is Farah Lisa Binti Patrozi. I'm a first year student from School of Physics, majoring in Medical Physics and I'm a presenter for this video. Assalamualaikum and hi everyone, my name is Christina Emalin Binti Muhammad Fizi and I'm from School of Physics, majoring in Pure Physics. So in this video, I'm the editor. seen the previous video? If yes, can you guess what is it? I bet you don't exactly know what is it. So without wasting time, let's go and explore it. As you can see in the video, it is a magnetic card reader and I am pretty sure that all of you have seen it before but you don't know how it works and its speciality. Nah, it's okay, we can learn it together. Okay, for now, listen and focus on my informative information about magnetic card reader. Don't skip this video and watch it till the end. A magnetic card is a rectangular plastic object that contains either a magnetic object embedded within the card or a magnetic strip on the card exterior. A magnetic strip card reader is also known as a hardware device that reads the information stored in the magnetic strip of the card. The information could be code or some personal information that help in the identification of an individual. It was in the 1960s when a Forest Perry, an IBM engineer, affixed a magnetic media to a plastic card. Since then, the technology has evolved with a technological advancement to offer extra safety and convenience for the users. Because of their extensive use, most magnetic cards employ the standards that describe a magnetic strip physical and magnetic characteristic on the plastic card. This standard also defines a specification for the storage format and information exchange. What are the type of the magnetic card reader? There are two types of magnetic card reader, which the first one is swipe. For using a such device, the user need to swipe the magnetic strip of the card hand over a specific area of the device. The device then read the strip to gather the information. The other one is insertion based magnetic strip card reader. For a such device, the user must insert the card inside a des designated space in the device for a few seconds. Then, the device notifies the user regarding the successful transmission of information from the card. Hi Farah! Hey, hi Emily! Um, have you ever heard about magnetic card reader? Because I'm still curious on how it works. So please explain it for me. Oh sure! Actually, a magnetic strip card reader is equipped with a device called a solenoid that can control the magnetized particle in a card strip. A solenoid is nothing but coil wound into a tightly packed helix. The coil wind around a magnetic metallic core that produces a strong magnetic field when current passes through it. A magnetic strip card is moved over the surface. It induces a voltage in the coils of the device. The voltage is then amplified, um, amplified to be recorded electronically and be read by the processor installed inside a reader to access the information. And as you can see above, above me, there are two main components involved to create a magnetic card reader, which is solenoid and processor. Do you know that the magnetic card reader has their own advantages and disadvantages? Come, let me show you. First, we have to move to the advantages of the magnetic card reader. The first advantage is this magnetic card reader is easy to use. Magnetic strip card can be easily installed and be used anywhere you are. It's only required a small device and the untrained user can easily understand its function. The next one is magnetic card reader is cost effective. 
when it is very commonly available in the market at a lower price. So, anyone can buy it since it is affordable and convenient to have it in to have this magnetic card reader. Next, the magnetic card reader is also secure. Most magnetic strip card readers use advanced technology that can offer a greater safety when using it and access control solution. As an example, if you run a large business, utilizing a magnetic card reader means you can easily pull data and keep track of who, of who frequently taking breaks and or skipping time. Other than that, the magnetic card reader also can be plugged into a machine that are using a USB support system, which can be operated seamlessly with a sales and inventory software. They also allow an easier time tracking customer purchases if you are interested in starting a loyalty program. In wait, have you think that this card reader has its drawback? The disadvantage of a magnetic card reader is this magnetic card reader can be damaged easily and from a small scratch or even from a wrong type of exposure of to a magnetic force. So we should be very careful while swiping a card onto the magnetic card reader. And it also does not work from a distance, meaning that it cannot be used from a far distance. So it is essential for the users uh, to come closer to reader for enable it to read the information. According to the website of the net card, a magnetic card reader also are not optimal to working in a marine environment. As an example, stored by a seashore, saltwater corrodes the head of the magnetic strip reader making it more prone to malfunction and requiring a repair or replacement. Have you feel more knowledgeable after hear about what is magnetic card reader? If yes, it was nice. Then I think our session has come to the end of the video. So to conclude, the magnetic card reader has given so many benefit for us in facing this technological era. Therefore, make sure to always upgrade ourselves to normalize using card while shopping to make use of magnetic card reader more frequently. Come, come, come. Okay. That's one, two, three. That's all from us. Thank you.